Hey you guys, welcome, 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 welcome. It's gonna be my little Pisces. This is gonna be December 2nd through the 16th. Just had the three of swords pop out. Some of you might be disappointed, or it might, might be vice versa, because I am reading your energy and then briefly on exterior energy, but it could be vice versa. Okay. So, Pisces. December 2nd through the 16th, 2019. Okay, so we got the Fool and we got the Moon. <clears throat> New starts, going towards the unknown. Okay, there's something that went down. You needed to detach from something. You're right in your own element. You're not seeing something. You just, you have the six of swords at the bottom of the deck. So, you got a brand new start here, though. In the next two weeks. Yours is more of like a futuristic current energy, which is, which is nice because... <sighs> I would just at Scorpio and, and Cancer and, and they were more past. And it's not like you were, I don't know. This is you staying optimistic though. I don't know if you know something's concealed from you though. Like make sure you remain who you are. Or, or it's like... I think your new beginning might be hard, you know. Um, let's see what happens when I clarify, but you have to be flexible in the next two weeks with whatever's going down. Because something, it looks like something's going to be revealed. <clears throat> Tell me about the fool for my Pisces. I don't know if this is saying it's time to explore other options or... The ones you already have in front of you, you got to be a little more flexible when it comes to figuring it out, which would tell me there needs to be a little perspective change. Tell me about the fool for Pisces. It's like going towards the unknown. Don't, don't forget who you are. Remain who you are. Pisces, please. Thank you. The world reversed. So something is not over. There's some cycle that's not over. I think it has to do with the King of Cups. Or something's going to come full circle. Tell me about the world. Someone's watching you guys because the moon is Pisces. It's also my Cancer card too, but whoever you're dealing with, whether it's the King of Cups or another Pisces, if you're cross-watching, they're watching you. I don't know if you had to put an end to something, but you didn't want to. Regardless, the world is reversed. Something's not done whether you think it is or not. Tell me about the moon. So six of wands reversed. So again, like something didn't work out. I'm almost positive Cancer had that same exact card in the same placement. Tell me about the six of wands reversed. But it's almost like if you think it's over, it's not. Yeah, they had that too. It's just, 
if something's not going right, or as you thought or expected, however it's going down for you. But there's some type of turnaround. Tell me about be your authentic self. There's some type of turnaround in the next two weeks. Someone you were dealing with is not was not telling you how they they were feeling. They were hiding their emotions. They they were hiding how they truly felt about this connection. So someone will obviously come back around, or or you, vice versa. However, however it's going for you. Um, tell me about the two of pence. And this might be you having to be, to me it's about perspective, changing something. Tell me, the cards don't even sound right. Two of pence. There we go. So if somebody was isolating themselves from you, they, they no longer want to. Um, you could be dealing with a Virgo. But again, it's, it's like that could be someone not soul searching. I'm really not looking at it like that. Okay. Yeah, see, it's it's all about perspective or some type of surrender. Surrendering is, is something like that going on. It's like you need to change your mind. Mom, I just the dog outside Okay. Lucy, seriously? <sighs> Sorry, troops. She just came in like a freaking wrecking ball. Here's a sign for ya. She came in like a wrecking ball. It's cause something's not done. It, whatever energy, whatever that you thought you completed was completed is not. It's coming back. And when it does, you're being asked to change your perspective. Because this person wasn't being true about how they felt about this connection by any means. Pisces. Feeling secure within yourself. The dynamics of a lifetime are complicated, but sometimes they really don't exist in the earthly dimension. But it's the environment that makes you feel a certain way. There's this trauma, there's blockages, there's lessons. Okay, your base chakra. This is all about your base chakra. It really needs to be worked on. Okay, um, which is the root the root chakra okay it's associated with the like um almost like what it's trying to say like the 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 tangible like the it, it's also associated with trusting belonging accepting okay especially if you're feeling lost and insecure or loss of energy or fear or anything like that it's because it's it's, there's not enough balance but to me it's like the change of perspective that's you, not necessarily them. Somebody was definitely concealing about how they truly felt about you in a connection, in a situation. And I think you think it's definitely over, but it's not. Like, the lesson hasn't been learned. Like, something still needs to come back around. Okay, so right now it's like you really need to be, to stay to stay positive and open to the possibilities. Okay, um, and, and please strengthen the root chakra. Work on it because... 
it's that's all about stability and inner strength and you can't it's, it's hard to create if that's not balanced so you can go on YouTube there's there's other things with the root chakra maybe I would do a chakra video I have in the past um, but that will help stabilize how you're feeling about a situation because you're, you're being asked for when it comes back around it looks like within the next two weeks you're being asked for, to keep an open mind my sense of smell is really heightened right now I don't know if that's what's going on with you guys or it's going to but other energy, exterior energy Okay, so you have the Five of Cups and the Ace of Cups. So someone's not feeling loved. Somebody is just hurt, hurt by whatever went down with you. Not feeling the love anymore. Only focused on pain. Yeah, see that that connection. You know, I, I don't know if someone's biting themselves in the ass right now because they didn't speak up and they weren't true to how they really felt. Okay, can't sleep not healing from a situation the world was reversed at the bottom of that deck too restless okay feeling insecure that could be somebody who's not single but i'm not looking at it like that right this second that to me is lack of just insecurity okay not they're not moving forward right this second they this is an energy that just does not know what to do with themselves so that could be a message for them for the root chakra versus you guys. It really just depends. If if things aren't moving for you right now and you feel really insecure, unsecure, and in lack of love, and you're only focused on the pain and you can't sleep, then focus on the root chakra. I, I feel like this is more my Pisces and this is more exterior. But it could be vice versa. Everyone's different, right? That's why I'm doing these reads like this this time around so you have an idea this is going to change within the next two weeks okay um but because something's coming full circle it's coming back around and, and the most important message for my pisces is is legitimately keeping an open mind when it does this person just needs to get out of this energy right now you know this person's definitely going through a dark night of the soul but this will get better in due time because i think this is the energy that's that's returning yeah see they're going to learn a lesson they're going to use their intuition they're going to go after their happiness okay so that's extremely positive for those who are really just focused on a love situation for somebody who does want someone back. Or even if you, at one point, you would have, like, yeah, I do. Now you're like, no. I think I think you will because I, I think the main problem that you guys had was lack of emotion. And Pisces water signs need emotional relationships and that's another reason why it looks like you guys let one go if that was the case because you weren't you weren't getting it it was lacking whether you knew something was being concealed or not it didn't matter it wasn't healthy for you so now that other energy that's all up in that energy is watching and they weren't true they were hiding how they really felt about this connection so when it does come back around you know, again, the universe is, is asking you, you know, to just change your perspective. Keep an open mind. So continue to remain positive. Be open to the, the possibilities. Okay. <laughs> Which I think you can do.
It's a very positive read. All right, guys. I hope that helped. Again, if you're looking for a reading, the link is below. My generals tend to hit people pretty spot on, but you never truly know. It makes sense to hit people spot on because of the current energy, right? But when it's all said and done, it's, it's nice to know what's really going on behind the scenes with your own personal reading. So I am still offering that. I am no longer doing phone videos, but um, I mean um, via phone chatting but i am still doing personal videos okay so you do have a new start within the next two weeks so please stay positive love you guys have a fantastic day bye